Let's talk about genetics. In this video, I'm going to teach you what are genetics. Genetics is nothing more. It's a piece of code that can work with multiple types instead of single type. Let's say you have built the component and this component is using the integer data type or number data type. You can build this reusable component so it can use string, boolean and number. You must specify the type during the function invocation. If you have built the generic function, you have to specify the type like number, string and the boolean. You can apply generics to functions, interfaces and classes. So we have talked about generics. You must specify the type. Let's talk about the type parameters. Type that client specify when they create the instance of the generic type. Like if you are a client, you have to specify the type of the function. Like it should return string, it should work with number or it should work with boolean. Yeah, you must specify the constructed type inside the angle brackets. Here is an example of the generic function. We have identity function. This is how you will specify your parameter type, which is T. You can use any alphabet, but T is the generic way, like T is the best way, like some T is the convention. All these developers are using the T. So you have to specify the type in the angle brackets and it can accept the T argument and it will return the T type. Let's say the first function I invoked, which is string. Like you can mention the string here, hello world, and it will return the output. Similarly, I passed the number argument, which is one. Now you will see the output two, which is one. 